What is going on guys? My name is Fusions and today we're back with some more Pokemon 25th anniversary McDonald's booster packs and I'm also going to open up one Pokemon 25th anniversary cereal booster pack. So let's get started guys. Okay so first of all we're going to put this one to the side for now. Um, here are the McDonald's booster packs. We got the two number twos, two number fours, and then two number threes. I was never able to get the number one uh, envelope, so that kind of sucks because this is already over. The promotion was supposed to end on March 8th, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm pretty sure this is over. I don't think any McDonald's have any more of these. So yeah, let's open these up. Let's take a look at the contents and then we'll open up the packs. Okay, so for the envelope number two, here is what we have inside. We got the packs, obviously. There we go. And then we got some stickers. So for this one, we got these. They look really awesome. I like uh, the stickers. For this one, we have, it's a different sheet, which is cool that you get, um, that I was able to get two different ones. And then you have these. I think this is where you're supposed to put the stickers or you put the Pokemon there. Yeah, um, simple things, but I really like the stickers, so that's good. And of course, like I said, the packs. Now, envelope number three. Envelope number three is a little bit more simple. We have the two packs, okay? And then we have the, this uh, sticker sheet. They're just bigger stickers. We got these starters in this uh, sticker sheet, which is nice. And then on this other one, we have the original starters. So awesome. Now to number four. And for number four, we have the same thing. We got the pack because they all come with the, the pack, which is nice. Imagine if you didn't get a pack and one of these. Yeah, that would not be good. So yeah, we got the two packs and then we have this little thing where you can put a trading card inside to basically like i don't know if you like a certain card you could just display it which is pretty cool so now let's get right into the packs we have six packs and one of these so let's get started okay guys so the goal for today is to try to see if i can complete the normal set not the hollows so i need cyndaquil chimchar and piplup that's all i need to complete the non-hollows but of course for the hollows, I need to get a lot of them. So let's see if we could get some new hollows. Let's get started. I am excited. I want to see if uh, I could get some of the new hollows that I don't have. We already pulled the hardest hollow, I would say. If you did not watch my other videos of uh, the McDonald's cards or booster packs, you should go back and watch it because I got some nice, nice pulls. So let's see. We have Trico, Tepig. Total dial, and for the hollow, we have a Torchic. Okay, so Torchic really likes to, uh, I don't know, it follows me around. I like it, I like Torchic, but it's following me too much. We're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna skip that pack. Let's continue onto the second pack. Here it is. Um, I think I have like three or four Torchics by now. So yeah, I don't wanna see any more Torchics. I better not get another Torchic because, uh, yeah, that's not going to be good. And I don't know if uh, it's a good card to be trading with. So I don't know if it's actually like good that I'm pulling them. But I mean, that's what I'm getting. We have Trico, Sobble, an, uh, a Tor okay, a Torchic. <laughs> and then for the Hollow, we have a Grookey. Okay, so that's really good because I don't have this Grookey. I have actually been missing a lot of the grass types of hollows so that's a good one that's a new one so that's really really good on to the third pack and then after this we're gonna open up the cereal pack but let's get started with this one first let's see if uh we could get more grass types uh hollows because like i said i only have well with that one with grookey now i have two uh grass type hollows and also water types i'm missing uh, a lot of those too so here we have bulbasaur chikorita total dial and for the hollow, we have a chest spin. Yes, so that's good because like I said, I'm missing a lot of the grass types. So we're getting new hollows. That's really good. I like this one too. So now onto the cereal pack. Uh, this set is different from the McDonald's set. And I don't think I'm gonna complete this one because you have to buy a cereal box to get one of these packs. And I do not wanna get a bunch of cereal that I'm probably not gonna eat. So I just bought one. Um, so yeah, let's see what's inside. I think you could get a, it says that you get a Pikachu, like 
you every pack has a Pikachu. So for me, um, one pack is enough as long as I get that holographic Pikachu. Also, just look at the pack. It looks so cool. Look at all the starters there. That's awesome. I wish they did this with like regular packs because this one looks really, really cool. So let's open it up and let's see if uh, there's actually a Pikachu in here. So like I said, only one. Oh, <laughs> everything fell. Oops. I hope I didn't damage any of the cards. It was a little hard to open it up, but here we go. And we only have three cards in this one. Okay, there we go. There's the Pikachu. Awesome. I really like this Pikachu and it's a promo. Look at that Sword and Shield 39. That's great. And then we got a Snome. And then we have a Yamper. Okay, so that's it for that pack. So let's move on. Here's pack number four of the McDonald's packs. Let's continue. Let's see if we could get some new, some more new hollows. All right. So here we and we haven't even pulled the regular cards that I need. It's only three. Come on. Charmander, Pop Leo, Mudkip, and then for the hollow, we have a Squirtle. Okay, so I do have a Squirtle, but this is a really cool hollow. I really like this one. I like how it cuts off, like the hollow pattern cuts off right there on the water. So the top part of them is not even hollow. Just that's the only part that's not hollow. So that's pretty cool. It's a nice card. Next pack. Here we go. All right. So none of the common ones so far, which is kind of a bummer. I'm going to have to trade for them. Hopefully somebody has them and I can trade. Froakie, Tepig, Rowlet. And then for the hollow, we have a Cyndaquil. Okay. I do have this one, which is kind of sad, but it's a Cyndaquil. Ah, okay, let's move on. Let's go to the next pack and the last pack for this video. At least, like I said, at least in my other openings, I did pull the hardest one. This is probably going to be my last pack like ever. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to get any more of these McDonald's packs. It was hard enough while the promotion was going on. And now that it's over, uh, it got even more difficult. So we got a Charmander. Cyndaquil. Yes, 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 yes. That's a good one. All right. That's good. Turtwig. And then for the hollow, we have a Bulbasaur, which is really good because I don't have it as a hollow. That's really, really good. All right, guys. So here are all the hollows that we pulled today. Here's the Pikachu. The promo Pikachu is awesome. I really like it. I mean, just get one of the cereals and you'll get it which is, uh, yeah, that's all you need from that set. We did get six hollows since we opened six packs. Three of them were, I already had them, and then the other three were new, so that's good. Half of them were at least really, really good. But that's it for this video, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you hit the like button. If you did, comment below if you completed the set. I wanna know if any of you guys actually completed the set. That's what I'm trying to go for. And subscribe, stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching, guys, and peace out.